latest challenge in STEM class was to build a balsa wood tower with certain specifications to satisfy Science Olympiad rules. The first criteria was to make a tower large enough to span a 20 by 20 centimeter hole. The top portion of the tower must pass through an 8 centimeter diameter opening. Finally, the tower must support a loading block at least 60 centimeters above the table. To begin, we made a prototype of the tower. Here is a brief clip showing why we did that. The length of the base is 18 centimeters and the base of the tower is 20 centimeters. The prototypes help to reduce the mistakes and it shows how long to make to each side. Then, we made a scale drawing of the tower. We used a scale of 1 to 3. A scale model helps reduce mistakes. Next, we made our final drawing on the board to model our tower after. Now it is time to begin construction. We first had to cut out the sticks to certain lengths to fit our model. Then, we glued the sticks in place, trying to be efficient with the glue so it doesn't add too much weight. Once we had two of the sides down, we laid them on the template and laid connector pieces across them, following the same pattern as the other sides. Finally, our tower was completed. Here were some steps we took to make our tower stronger. So in our tower, to reduce the bulging stress, we put these horizontal pieces to keep uh, the wood in place. We also used diagonal pieces of wood to prevent twisting or swaying of the tower. Um, an important feature of this tower is these spacer pieces here. Basically, they make it so there's less of a gap between the wood so the glue gets a better bond. And finally, on the bottom, these pieces fit in here, they don't overlap each other. So to make it stronger, we put another piece across to better connect them. 